Morning guys, meal one post cardio is going to start out with four caramel rice cakes. We have the oats in the microwave, then we'll get the protein out and I'll show you what that looks like. Like I said, just got done with 30 minutes of fasted cardio. Alright guys, got some nice thick proats right here. Two scoops of that fudge brownie, iso whey, and a cup of oats. Perfect. Prepping up meal two before I get to class. Put some ketchup on this because I will be eating this in class. At the last bit of the ketchup here, this is when you take the top off. See if we can shake out some more. There we go. Don't want to get it everywhere, but I think that's good enough. And all right, we'll call it there. Alright guys, so, like I said, I'm going to eat this about 10.45 when I get to class, two hours after my net, my last meal. And we'll see what the meal is after that, after I'm all done with morning classes. Alright guys, just got back from that shoulder workout. It was, uh, I'm going to say, pretty much a lighter workout than usual. I didn't record it just because it wasn't all that interesting. I was kind of scaling back the volume, scaling back the weight just a tad. I don't do that a lot. That's not something I do. I usually go pretty hard for six days and then I'll take an off day. But I didn't want to take an off day. I wanted to hit my shoulders still and I hit them. But I didn't want to go in there and obliterate a muscle group that was already sore because that's not the smartest thing to do. My traps are already sore from yesterday. And uh, it's not normal for me to be this sore, but I hit 275 for eight on the bench a couple days ago. And ever since then, my chest has just been wrecked. Like, my pecs are like just, they're just sore all around. And I, like, when your pecs are that sore, there's a good chance your shoulders are a little worn down too. And I can feel it, like doing lateral raises and stuff on my rotator cuff. Just, I'm just really fatigued in like this upper body. Just everything pushing right now is just like, it, it, it's taking a toll. So. As far as this week goes, I got one more day, tomorrow's leg day, and then I got an off day. So, like I said, I scaled back the shoulder routine a little bit, let myself recover. Once I recover from this week's training, which was epic, PRs all around, next week, I'm pretty confident I'm going to come back even better. So let's get this post-workout meal in right now. I got to get this microwave back on. Right here. We're going to do some proats, and I'll show you guys what the meal looks like. Post-workout meal's going down. Two cups of oats in these bowls here. First bowl, we got the cup of oats with the two scoops of ISO 100 fudge brownie using that generic brand Splenda. Second bowl, we just got the oats there. I'll probably just add Splenda and cinnamon to that. Cooked in water and sipping on that kiwi strawberry seltzer. Watching some YouTube interview, D12, M&M. Pretty solid. All right, guys, post-workout meal. All right, guys, back from my last class of the day, last class on Friday, officially the weekend, and finally getting to, what's this, meal, meal four, yep, last carb meal of the day, but we also get fats, so we get two tablespoons here, 50 carbs, 45 protein, 16 fat from peanut butter, and of course, ketchup will be used, so doing the Uncle Ben's rice, and uh chicken breast just just a solid combo right there pretty stable currently in the uh, dorm room scenario
guys, back from grocery shopping right now. I'll show you what I got. Well, actually, I won't show you what I have. I already showed you my groceries, but I'll show you what I'm eating, I guess. First, I got my laptop here. Not eating that. Let's see if you can see it in the laptop light right here. Chicken, peanut butter, and this Tupperware right here. I'm gonna eat outside, get some good scenery. Waterfront right there. This bag of lettuce. This Coke Zero in which I finished, and my ketchup in which I forgot. If you enjoyed this one, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Go ahead and comment below any questions or concerns that you guys might have. You can follow me on Instagram at nick.berg. Go and enjoy this chicken and lettuce with the peanut butter and the ketchup that I unfortunately don't have. Until that next video, guys, I will see you then. Peace out.